everybody, my name is Agent Psycho, and we're going to get started on the second episode of T-Boy, which is what I like to call the Binding of Isaac, if I'm feeling lazy enough. But in any case, um, yeah, quite a few of you uh, who did watch the uh, first episode of my T-Boy thing um, did enjoy it, so I mean, regardless, I was going to continue anyway, but it's glad that some people actually do enjoy watching the Binding of Isaac, so... Um, Last time, people did leave comments saying that, you know, as awesome as my backgrounds are, um, I should edit them out, because, you know, it's kind of distracting, and I understand that, so I will try doing that um, this episode, and if things don't work out, then I'll let you guys know ahead of time, or in the next episode itself, uh, but I should be able to edit it, um, so that you guys only see the gameplay. I mean, I should be able to anyway. I'm not that much of a noob at Sony Vegas, but in any case, we'll get started. I'm going to use my favorite character as Kane, because that's my favorite character. I mean, Isaac it is... I only use Isaac just because of the fact that he has a D6, but, um, no, Kane... He's got the luck foot. I mean, you can't really go wrong with luck foot. All your pills are going to be good, and um, yeah, for the most part, you should be able to be. You, it should be smooth sailing. But then again, knowing my luck, I can always oh, fuck. I can always have uh, find you know instances where Kane's luck foot just doesn't quite make it through. In the words of Northern Lion, this is the only game that you'll ever find yourself uh, uh, you'll ever find yourself saying, "Shoot the poop! It's good for you." The guys over at Team Meat have a sick sense of humor, even though you know, technically speaking, Team Meat didn't create um, buying and advising. It's still the same person, goddammit. it! The troll known as Edmund McMillan. That's a spike room, Mino Gusta. Oh, what do we have here? So many bombs I can't even get to! What the fuck? Sister Maggie, right? Or, God damn it, little chat, fuck. I don't know if little Jed's gonna end up saving my life, but for now, he's just kind of useless. Sorry, that's just how it's gonna be. So many bombs there, I would love to get my hands on, but unfortunately I have no way of getting to- Oh god, double monsters. Oh Jesus. <laughs> that was actually a close call. I prefer the monstro that doesn't jump at all. The champion, uh, the champion monstro that doesn't move at all. Just constantly jumps around, spitting shit at you. Seems like their health is slowly being whittled down. Yikes. Oh, they jump. <laughs> they both jump at the same time. Okay, one of them's down, and just another one is. Alright, good. Bandy? I've never gotten that item. Isn't that the item where you that you get when you, uh. I remember getting it. I did it when, during the. Uh, funny story, actually, before I get this, uh, bandage. Um. I was actually doing the, uh. The Super Meat Boy challenge uh, in, the, in the challenge section of the Binding of Isaac in the, in the menu screen. And funnily enough, I managed to actually get uh, full Meat Boy. I mean, you start with full Meat Boy, level 4 Meat Boy, in the challenge itself. But I actually managed to get another full Meat Boy, which is absolutely hilarious. I really wanted to record that, but um, I don't know. I wasn't able to because I forgot to. But it was actually really, really funny that I actually managed to get two full Meat Boys at the same time and I suppose this is the uh, this is the um, reward that is unlocked when you actually get that so let's see what it does whoa that's fucking awesome that is fucking awesome not gonna lie it is two spear hearts and a full heart <laughs> wow that's a lot now I have three now I'm pr pr pretty much sitting happy here with three spear hearts and um three hearts like just normal hearts that's a little that was a lot more than i could have asked for holy shit these guys are gonna be kind of confusing because sometimes their shot patterns you can't really predict like they'll go somewhere else when you don't expect them to just snipe them out <laughs> i believe i should have enough range to take this guy out no problem good. little chad you're fucking useless if only you were sister maggie at least you'd be useful for something 
Uh, salt machine, no. Even though as cane, uh, salt machines are actually pretty useful, but no, I would like to save my uh, money for something else. Okay, so here's the uh, trick that Northern Lion patented. The... The strafe runs. Yes, indeed, the strafe runs. There we go. Shit. I say Northern Lion patented this because I learned it from him. This is quite useful. It'll take some time, but you'll get there eventually. Except for these assholes who are hiding in the corner like this. Eventually you'll be able to get them too, but you have to basically time your shots perfectly. Either that, or you can just go over here, which I should have done. Like that. Yay. Thank you, Chad, for giving me a heart I can't even fucking use unless there's an arcade here, which I highly doubt. Oh, good, that turret head is not within range. Fine by me. No, my eyes tearing up for some reason. Maybe I'm becoming like Isaac, or in this case, in this case, Kane. Another bomb, sweet deal. I feel kind of tempted to go to the shop just to hope that it's actually greed in there. This is one of those few float times when I actually want greed to be fucking in there. Then again, we all know Edmund McMillan's popular troll engine known as the Binding Advisor. Oh wait, we're playing it right now. I'm actually curious as to what my uh, stats are right now, after we kill this human popcorn, which, again, is pa another turn patented by Northern Line. Let's check our, uh, damage. So I actually have a pretty decent damage. Three damage, mm, that's not bad. I thought Isaac started with two or something. So that ma that makes Kane actually more powerful than, uh, ooh, that's a lot of stuff, uh, than Isaac in uh, initially. I never knew that. And we'll see what the treasure room has. Uh, slot machine. That fucking sucks. Looks like we'll be having, we'll be going basically our own for for now. Well, the only good item we've received so far is the super meat boy bandage or the bandage girl item or just a bandage for God's sake. Oh God. Um, they'll all be funneling out of here, so I might as well shoot them until they come. Here. They they're dodging. They're actually smart. Smart AI. What do you know? All right, let's see what this chest has. Another half heart, fucking a. There should be an arcade here somewhere. I swear to God, there is one. Another. Oh, but this time we actually have a tinted rock. That's good. Potentially it can give us the rock or spirit hearts. Worst case scenario, keys or a single bomb. I've, I've had that happen to me before. <laughs> Hence, bad luck. But we'll see what it has. Yay, the rock. What more could we have asked for? Now we have bloody tears. Sweet. Actually, I think Kane actually starts with the. Uh, with um, two two attack, my bad, because we got the uh, super meat boy bandage. That could have, I think that caused us to ha gain a gain um, plus one attack. I'm not too sure uh, because <laughs> bandage the bandage item enough it, or it, by itself is such a good item by giving you a heart and plus two spirit hearts that I doubt that it gives you more stat increases. But I mean, I don't know, maybe you could. I highly doubt it though. But now, we're sitting pretty because we, now we basically have 5 damage on top of that bloody tears. I mean, on on basement number 2, that's not- you can't really ask for much more than that. <laughs> It'll be hilarious if they decide to give me the D6 on the, on the boss room, but I highly doubt they would. Check for the secret room. Nope, not there, so that must mean it must be over here. And we'll see what the secret, secret room contains for us. Kablooey. Hello, six cents. Ooh, the, uh, the uh, shop is now worthy. Or it, the shop is now worth going to now that we have 18 cents and then we know that we can get an, uh, a, one of those 15 cent items. So that's good. There are so many hearts around here. We've It would be quite the uh, thing to actually go around getting the... Uh, get like an arcade... Uh, you know, I'm actually tempted to buy this tarot card in hopes that it's a temperance. And uh, potentially we can get the uh, blood bag from it, but nah, it's too risky. For now, we'll just buy the treasure map. Treasure map's always a classic. Unfortunately, if we only had two more cents, I would definitely buy that uh, spirit heart. Fortunately, we don't have our uh, we don't have uh, luxury to do so. And, uh, and f but though we could try bombing this, and then you know, getting a few cents out of that. Should we go for it? Why not? We got one more cent! Fuck you, game! Fuck you! Well, we'll just have to go into the, uh... 
the boss room in hopes that they'll drop something that'll give us more coins. There it goes, nothing. Let's go, let's do this. Larry Jr. will give us a spirit heart. <laughs> Which pretty much, you know, was like, oh, hey, we know, the the game engine's trolling us by saying, oh, you know, we know that you didn't get a spirit heart in the, uh, in the, uh, in the, uh, shop, so we'll just give you this J Larry Jr. and, and knowing that you'll be able to get another spirit heart from this anyway. Well, why couldn't you have given me both of them to begin with? Is what I want to ask. Yay, and a deal with the devil. Yay. Uh, this is speed up, which I actually don't mind because I think that, um, the small rock, uh, which you can see is stuck in Kane's head, painfully enough, um, actually decreases your speed by a little bit, so that wooden spoon I actually don't mind. Um... Fuck it. Brimstone, bitch! Your argument is invalid. Now I feel like a boss. Hmm. Interesting. Well, we'll go then. Kind of, I'm kind of uh, pissed that we, we left that uh, spear heart back there uh, because, you know, of the fact that we could have gotten another spear heart, which is obviously very valuable now that we don't have, now that we only have one full heart container. Oh god, these guys. Well, now that my damage is so damn high, we can, we can like, almost one-shot these guys. See, look, we have, we have, well, it technically says that we have full damage, but that's only because Brimstone, uh, makes your damage meter go, like, max. But it actually still has the hidden, uh, gauge. If only I got three cents earlier! Fuck you, game! This game is trolling me now. Well, who doesn't it troll, right? I mean, it always trolls Northern Line, but that's, that's, like, common knowledge, you know? And yes! If you guys have never seen the uses of brimstone, this is what it looks like. I'm a fire and laser bomb. Yes, it is quite hilarious. Now, if we only could ask for a few um, rates of fire, uh, that is the coin sack, right? Yeah. Uh, it might be useful. I mean, most of the time, it's only given gonna give us pennies. But, I mean, you, 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 know, you never know. It might actually give you uh, a dime or something like that. I've seen it give me a dime before. Oh god, these guys. Alright, good. I can actually one-shot them uh, to their ooze state. That's good. That's nice. Because I think with standard brimstone and with standard damage brimstone, you can't do that. I don't know. I could be pulling that one out of my ass. but um, No, actually, standard brimstone can actually hit them uh, one-shot and they should be dead. But... Or to their ooze state, rather. Oh god, oh, I, that's good, because I don't need, really need to waste my bomb anymore. Yeah, that worked out for the best. Um, we should actually, because we've already visited the uh, treasure room, we should actually go fight the boss now. And one one tip for you guys, if you guys are the Binding of Isaac noobs, or don't even know any, don't know much about Binding of Isaac, uh, when you have Brimstone, make sure to charge it when you, before going to a room you, you've never been in before, because when you uh, start the room, you can actually uh, start, uh, start out by uh, using Brimstone right away. Wow, that was... To quote Northern Lion, STUPID FUCKING DAMAGE! Oh, we got- well, at least we got- we got- got a net gain of, uh, a Spirit Heart. Yay. And Nickel as well, from the coin sack. Uh, Red Patch, I believe that Trinket gives us, um, increased damage when we're, when we're down to half health. I think, I don't know. We'll see what this pill does. Range up, completely fucking useless with Brimstone. Um, what's this here? A Chariot, which might be useful. Uh, we'll go back outside, because now we'll go look for a shop, because now we have another 15 cents to blow our money off on. But, if my intuition is correct, we should be meeting Greed, so let's not be surprised here if we do indeed meet Greed. Hey, pop up, bitch. Thank you. Actually? Fuck yeah! Book of Revelations! Fuck you, bitch. I should say, fuck you. That guy, that coin shop guy. Ah, oh, fuck! Yeah, now I should say, fuck you. Go burn in hell. We're gonna blow that. Really? It missed? There we go. But now I'm really glad that uh, the coin shop guy... I like to call that guy who hangs in the... Uh, oh, that funny thing. Let me show you this. If you guys didn't know. You know the guy in the uh, coin shop guy? This hanging guy? I like to call him the coin shop guy. For whatever reason. Um, just look, just pay attention to him. He, His face changes every time you come in and out of the coin shop. So sometimes, if I'm bored, I'll just come out in and out of the shop just to see his face change. It's quite hilarious. He's got a smiley face this time. 
Still's got the funnest smile on face. Change your face, damn it! Oh, he's. Oh, fuck you! You're sticking your tongue out at me. Fuck you! I'm not coming to your shop ever again. I don't have any money anyway. Go into this thing. Teleport. No me gusta. The I am. I've only ever been to the I am error room twice. Because it's a very rare chance you'll ever go into the I am error room. Again, you can only go into the I am error room using teleport uh, items like telepills or the uh, teleportation remote, like the one you just saw back in the uh, the boss room, the mob trap room, as Northern Light likes to call them. But um, yeah, those are those are the only incentives to have teleport. Otherwise, they're just useless, and sometimes they can end up buff fucking you. All right, good. We, can, we managed to take them out, take out the Congo lions just by itself. But we're gonna have to take out. Uh, these things as well. Oh shit. Oh, come on! Charge faster, damn you! Fuck you! That's the thing about Brimstone that pisses me off, because sometimes if you have too high damage, the rate of fire, your rate of fire isn't, j isn't very good. In fact, it slows down considerably. Range up, pill. Completely fucking useless as usual. You can't even one shot these guys, motherfuck. Well, this is all going downhill now. Oh, actually, so I- Oh, well, thanks a lot. <laughs> I don't have to waste my bomb anymore. Screw you, bitches. Oh, thank you. Oh, they both gave me something. Oh, nice of you. I can't even use them anyway. And another single heart from a chest. Psh, wow, thanks. I really fucking needed it. I'll put a bomb down here, hopefully kill something. Oh, wow, really? Oh, not to worry, we've got our two extra hearts back, but... Every time I lose- Oh, fuck you! I got. I could have had so many spirit hearts by now. <sighs> Jesus. Once again, I still consider myself to be a noob at this game because I still take way too much, and to quote Northline, way too much stupid damage. All right, good. Oh, and they found the secret room for me. Well, I already knew where it was, according to the map. But now I don't have to waste an actual bomb in order to get there. Local revelations. Why not? Ace of Spades? I really don't know what the Ace of Spades does, but I think I'll hold on to it, because the Red Patch is pretty much useless to us, because we'll never be able to use this effect unless we lose all our fucking spirit hearts, and I obviously don't want to be in that position. Fortune Teller. Why not? Fuck yeah, that was worth it. One cent for a spirit heart? Uh, the Emperor. Actually, what we're going to do is... We're going to use the chariot card. We're going to come back to the secret room here. Or is this, yeah, this is the secret room. We're going to come back to the secret room with the emperor card and hold down to the emperor card as long as we can because that is obviously going to be very useful when we're going to fight Isaac or um, or Mom's heart if if need be. We'll spend this. We'll waste this last cent. Another good perk about uh about ooh actually we're going to take the matchstick. That gives us more bomb drops. Uh, one good another good perk about Kane is that whenever you're using these fortune tellers, the fortune teller will never give you those stupid text messages. So yeah, there we go. So we'll come back to you, uh, secret room. Oh, actually, I couldn't, I can't believe I missed this. Were there seriously two, uh, two one of those uh, tinted rocks in this room? If that's the case, then this room was treating me very nicely. One shot Larry Jr. GG. No re. Get out of my life. Looks like we'll have to use a bomb to get to, to, to this chest. Why not? It might contain, uh, so, for us. Ah, uh, never mind! And this red chest, two bombs! <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, Jesus. These guys are dangerous. You want to stay away from them as far as you can. Alright, line them up. Line them up. And... Bwah. Boom. Oh, God! Troll bomb! Troll bomb! Troll bomb! Fuck you, troll bomb. Catacombs 2, uh, we haven't gone to the secret room, uh, the treasure room yet, so we might as well hold off on the, uh, boss room fight until we actually find ourselves in the, uh, mob boss room. Or the, uh, treasure room, what am I talking about? Pentacle. Still holding on to this, uh, fire button, uh, spike room. Uh, no thank you. Come on, charge faster, damn it. I really want, like, the tears up pills. Oh, yes, line them up. <laughs> I have a feeling it's greed. Let's go in. No, it wasn't greed! Damn it, I wasted a key. Whatever, I have a lot anyway. Uh, and they could, we could also possibly buy that, um, spirit heart as well, if we do find, end up finding enough money for that. Get, oh, God. Ah, I'm trapped. 
Oh, triple kill. Oh, the revelation charge again. Thank you. And we Kamikaze? Bullshit. Screw you. Literally, we haven't gotten any good treasures. The pan <laughs> So much for Kane's luck foot. For fuck's sake. I don't think we'll be able to uh, buy anything from there unless we unless the uh what is it? The boss drops for us Pageant Boy. And even then I kinda don't want Pageant Boy to begin with. Because Book of Revelations will always give us a steady supply of hearts as so long as we don't waste go around wasting them. Come on in here. We might as well just fly off at the boss right away. We've already gone to everything else. Um peep, right? Uh, chariot time! Time to evacuate. Well, that was rise the rise of finish too. We're doing pretty good damage on Peep right now. Ooh, missed barely missed that one. Cherry card is one of the best cards. Just just telling. Ooh, stem cells. Yes. Yes, this game is that morbid. Uh, stem cells gives us plus one uh, heart container. Oh uh, Krampus. God damn it. I don't want to fight you, Krampus. Oh god. Fuck you, Krampus. I don't want your Christmas present. I walked into that. God damn it. Oh god. Run. Run, Isaac. I mean, Kane. He should be almost dead. This is where having a lot of damage with um, with Brimstone is very, very helpful. Does Lump of Coal actually stack with... Uh with brimstone it would be really awesome if that did well whatever we'll have to find out later but for the most part uh for the, in the end oh by the way we were, we're about to forget our emperor card can't have that can we oh, excuse me so just gonna drop a bomb here go in get our uh, emperor card um i don't know um we're gonna save our money even though we could potentially get a lot of more good stuff, maybe spirit hearts, maybe better trinkets, maybe even better tarot cards. Well, you can't really get better than the you can't really get much better than the Emperor except you know, unless you get like the Sun. The Sun is like arguably the best card out there, but the Emperor I think is a little bit more useful uh, in the long run. In case we'll just just uh, throw blood on all these fires. Yes, <laughs> put out putting off fires with blood. Yes, logic of um only a mining of Isaac. Hashtag only in. And now we'll get six cents. And another cent from the fire. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Uh, secret shop, uh, secret Room Man. Oh, by the way, the Secret Room uh, guy, uh, his face also changes with uh, with uh, every time you go in there as well. So. Pretty much every, every thing, like every person you see in this game uh, that doesn't attack you, their face will change every time you meet them again. <laughs> or that's how they're supposed to be programmed. Uh, oh god. We got laser flies. Oh, show. Oh. See them skills, man. You see them skills. Bwah. We found a uh, boss already, huh? Interesting. We are not going to go in there as right now, because maybe the treasure room will have something good for us. <coughs> no, not really. Saying that all the f other fucking treasure rooms didn't have anything for us to have. Uh, the first one was Chad. Okay, Chad is at least useful for giving us hearts if we need them. But even then, that's kind of useless because what are we gonna have need for uh, hearts for anyway? Unless we find like an arcade or something. Oh God, Wrath. Well, he's not that hard. It's just Super Wrath who's just maniacally difficult because he just spawns troll bombs everywhere. <laughs> Fucking nightmare if there was anything called if, if there was such a thing as a uh, Ultra Ultra Wrath. And with my luck, I'm pretty sure there is, but I haven't run into one yet. And thank God I haven't. Just imagine what what uh what kind of oh wow charge faster brimstone fuck you. Wow, really? Sometimes you can't you can't do anything but blame it on the weapon type you have. Like really, brimstone? Why you no charge faster? Leapers? Why you no die faster? Fucking annoying piece of shit. Though the coin sack is, I feel, going to go a long way. We see three of these rooms already, except this time this thing has an asshole fire. The the darker flamed fires are because they can actually shoot you if you get too close. What the hell is that? Isn't that Halo of Flies? Halo of Flies. Okay, so at least Halo of Flies will give us um, an added defense matrix. As you can see here, it gives us two flies that will hover around us, and they will block 
um, incoming attacks if the flies get in the way. So, yeah. On top of that, they will be permanent flies. So even if we, uh, even if they can take multiple, uh, as many hits as they want. Since we have so many hearts, we might as well give this guy our hearts. And we found a secret room. Hmm. We've already been here though. Blah. So this is Demon Judgment. He wants hearts instead of the other beggar guy, and we'll give it to him. Oh, I see it. I see a tender rock over there. Whatever. We'll proceed. We'll proceed to give him our hearts because he could potentially give us a really badass um, demonic item. What is this? Full health. Uh, I really didn't need that, but I mean, it'll, it'll let us give uh, give Demon Judgment here even more of our hearts. Um, Guppy's paw. Ew. No, I don't want that. Fuck you. If only I had Isaac's D6 right now. And trading a bomb for a key? Not really the best. Judgment! What do you know? Demon judgment and judgment in the same room. How surprising. Gonna take out this nub first. Another reference to Northern Lion's own glossary of the various dining of Isaac enemies in this game. If we find like a whole, like a hidden cache of, uh, of, uh, what is it? I forget that one. Of money, then we'll definitely go to judgment. Uh, for now, though, I feel like we're gonna run into greed. Okay, uh, maybe we haven't run into greed. So basically, we're gonna be running into greed any time now. I'm betting it's gonna be the shop and uh, the desk part too. For now, though, treasure map and compass—that's a pretty badass comp combination. Not gonna lie. And the shop has actually been very good to us by uh, by giving us like a whole array of things. And there's another tinted rock. How many tinted rocks are gonna be in this game? I'm amazed that I've actually managed to catch all these long. It did give us a net. I was kind of hoping for spirit hearts, you know. They did give us a, a net profit of bombs, but I kind of preferred um, having a spear gaining. Oh, what the fuck! Come on, Brimstone! Don't fuck me like this! <sighs> really? God damn. I don't know if that was a voice crack, but probably some, some of you guys, you guys probably heard it that way. <sighs> really, no? Why do you not charge faster? Um. Sure, let's take the spirit heart. Cause I mean, we might as well spend it here anyway. Cause I have, I'm, I'm pretty sure, I'm definitely sure the next shop on this, on the deaths part two is going to be, uh, is going to contain greed. And unfortunately, for uh, we might as well pick, we might as well get to where this, what this chest has. I swear to God, if it only had, if it only has one heart in it. Oh, never mind. It has quite a few money. It has quite a few monies in it. Yay. Might as well go ahead and fight the boss now. I mean, what the hell cares? I mean, Judgment could pay out in four cents, but I highly doubt it. And on top of that, oh, war, he's kind of a pain. At least it's not as bad as Conquest. God, Conquest is such a bitch. Uh, live bombs, they're not that bad, but I've had instances where uh, the live bombs actually um, blew each other up and knocked them towards me like that. They could have done that. Uh, he's trying again. Let's see. Nice. We should be fast enough to uh, skirt him around uh, like this. Yeah, like that. At least he's not a champion or where he uh, spits out bullets as soon as he does as soon as he does that. Uh, meat boy or cube of meat. Now we have pretty much maximum def def defense because uh, the maximum amount of familiars that you can have rotating you at any given time is three, including Meat Boy. If you had to have three flies and you got the cube of meat, then uh, the cube of meat would replace um, one of the flies. Um, one for Sister Maggie, or two for flying. This is actually a really hard decision. Um... Can't be wasting time like this. We'll take it. Lord of the Pit gives us flying. And Lord knows, <laughs> pun intended, Lord knows that uh, flying is really, really awesome in this game. Curse of Darkness, fuck. Oh god, these chubs. Well, now that I have flying and what is it? Um, Flying, that's no longer a problem to me. Gongo Lions, yep. Flying is just if you get if you have an opportunity of getting flying, take it. Even if it's even if like you know in this case it took away all the re rest of my uh, spirit remaining uh, heart containers. It's just so useful that uh, oh thank God uh, Meat Boy actually saved me from that fly there. We'll take it anyway. Uh, pills, I forgot what that does. I know I've taken it before, but I just forgot what it actually did. Leapers, fuck. Shit, shit, shit. 
against leapers, I highly recommend that you guys actually uh, move in such a way that you move diagonally. Because because of leapers actually fire, oh god, the leapers fire in a uh, perpendicular fashion. So if you if you move diagonally, then they're always going to miss you. Just make sure that you don't actually run into other leapers. So there's it. There's that. Full health. Um. Well, the problem is we don't. Full health is pretty much useless to us now because we don't have any more heart containers. And even then, if we don't have a lot of heart containers, it's like it's almost as if why even bother, right? Wow, even more money. The chest have been very been being very generous to us uh, later and uh, later floors here. Ah oh, shit! Brimstone in charge! What? the- Now the game's slowing down because there's so much information being processed. All right, good. All right, let's go in here. Uh, Bob's. Curse, right? Yeah, five poison bombs. Okay, that that's pretty good. It'll it'll give us the ch uh, it'll give us uh poison damage, uh with our bombs. So might as well take that. I mean, it's, 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 it's at least better than fucking Kamikaze. That thing is just fucking ridiculous. Uh, spike room. Uh, no. Sorry. Have we been up here? Yes, we have. Yes, we have. Because we've already been to the boss fight. Uh, why did I ignore all these bombs? Huh, I wonder. Why not, right? We're not going to have any more use for the keys anymore. Oh, well, unless we want to go to the chest. In which case, I would actually prefer to start saving up my keys, but... <laughs> well, it's kind of useless now. Yep, expected it. Greed, bitch. Yep, we can just three-shot greed. Hell yeah. And plus Book of Revelations. Sweet. Sweet deal. <laughs> One-shot those guys. Mikusta. It seems that if you get a poison effect uh, with your bombs, like Bob's Rotten Curse or something like that, it seems like most uh, all the explosions, even if they're not your own from your own bombs, it seems like they also get like a curse, like those poison textures as well. Oh, oh, jeez, that was close. That uh, poison turret has me worried the most. Shit. Come on, gotta kill that last one. Kill it with fire. Okay, good. But now where to go? Uh, radioactive spiders. Not that I fucking care, because I can just hang out over here. And they can't do anything about it, bitch. Oh wow, that missed. Alright. 26 cents, we're rolling. Uh, unfortunately can't get that now. I believe that because this is full necropolis, we can't really go into the boss room without coming out because we'll be fighting mom. Okay. They just keep giving me stuff that I don't even really need anyway. Uh, why not? Well, at least it gave, it gave us our key back. So we meet Judgment this sometime down there in the womb. Well, he might give us something good. Oh, jeez, masses of enemy. Oh, God. How I hate these things with a passion. Thank God I have brimstone and flying. And these guys are gonna be a fucking pit. See why I hate spiders? Fucking assholes. Line them up and knock them down. And I believe I've, we've explored. Now that uh, we've explored all the rooms, I wanna say. Uh, yes, we did explore all the rooms. I... well, we have 23 bombs, we might as well try looking for a secret room. It might be some time, though. Let's see here. Uh, this could be a place. Uh, let's check. Nope. Let's see, going down here. Uh... It's like two down. And then that. Hmm, it's not pro it's probably not around here. Uh, let's just check if it's here anywhere. Actually, it actually goes down, so we might as well check here. Oh, here it is, there it is. Six more cents. Why the hell not, right? And because we have so many goddamn bombs, and I don't want to... Wait, hold on. I can't go through there. Hmm, interesting. I believe this will lead us down to the boss room. 
All right. We're coming to kill you, mom. Is this this type where... Oh no, it spawns the asshole enemies. Okay, never mind. Yeah, this is... This is asshole -ish. Thank god we have brimstone so we can just lay down on this freaking... Yep, she's down. Alright, Polaroid. So we're gonna try to go to... Let's just shot speed up. It's completely ass useless. Now we'll go to the womb. Ooh, there's the easy room right there. Thank God for not having curse of this. Fortune teller? Sure, why not? Start to lag. Uh, because we do have everything here, um, I'm kind of interested to see what's in the uh, what is it called the library. So we're gonna go check it out there. Uh, temperance. Well, if only we got that card before. <sighs> Fucking bull. Monstro has quite a bit of. Should be down though. There we go. Another key. Oh god, these vaginal bomb flies. Or not bomb flies, but vaginal silkworms. <laughs> another definition or another term coined by Northern Lion. They're both telepathy for dummies. That was a complete waste of a key. We might as well try looking into the mob trap room, because I mean we have brimstone, we have flying, there's nothing we can't do. Oh god, troll bomb! Really? Fucking fetuses! Wow, brimstone charge, damn it! She gave me that triple kill. Anything? Because in the womb, uh, the uh, tinted rocks can't really. You can't really detect them anymore. They're hidden, so you kind of have to guess at what they contain. Dare I? A single tarot card? Fuck, man, that's right. Oh, shit. Enjoy that. Oh, now that we got the Polaroid, we're gonna have invulnerability every time we get hit. Sweet fucking deal. Oh god, monstros. I forget I keep forgetting there's double monstros here. Oh, shit. Come on, charge faster, Brimstone. I was hoping for a double kill run like, right there, but unfortunately it doesn't seem to be the case. The world. The world is pretty much useless to us now, because we have a combination of um, compass and map. Like, look at that, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> useless. That was a complete waste of time and health. Because we have so many bombs, we might as well try checking around for uh, tinted rocks that are disguised as those normal rocks, but I don't think we'll be getting you anywhere anytime soon. Temperance, that's right, this is completely as useless now to us. So, on our way to the boss, might as well write. Take all these nubs. Right, more bombs and more money that we can't even use. How great is that? Oh, shit. As you can see, Halo Flies and Q of Me is like an awesome, awesome uh, defense combination. Greatly reduces your chances of getting hit for no reason. <laughs> There's our temperance thing anyway. Uh, shit. Well, now that we've gotten hit, we have Polaroid, and because we don't have any health, um, or any normal spirit heart for that matter, we'll gain invulnerability for a slight time. Alright, thank you for coming. Nope. Alright. Wait, that's death, right? Okay, so it's not conquest. Thank God for that. Now 
we have brimstone, we don't have to worry about his sight set. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck. Come on. Oh, he's doing that. Ha. The fucking knights are dead. What are you gonna do now, bitch? Wait for it charge. Oh, shit. Come on. Come here, bitch. Come here. Yee, buddy. There's a second cube of meat. What do you want, devil? <laughs> Two things that I don't even want. Or that I can't even get. Or I, I, I suppose I can get them. Except I don't know what the requirements are. Uh, Curse of the Lost. Well, that's not really bad. It's the Curse of the Darkness that's really annoying. Uh, full health. Well, I can't really use that. got for me. <laughs> a lot of fucking money I don't even need. <gasps> Why must you be this cruel game? Unless I run to like judgment. And there is a uh, arcade up there. I could, I suppose I could try going there. Yeah, in fact, we might as well. You never know what, what we might run into in the, in the meantime. Uh, pill we haven't seen before. Let's see what this does. Bad gas. Okay, whatever. At least now we know what it does. Uh, sure we're not. Ooh, yes, jackpot. Fucking jackpot. Nothing there. So we're gonna waste our money here at the, at the uh, good old arcade. Ah, fuck you. Now, bad thing is about with uh, brimstone. Um, actually, we're gonna go out there and we're gonna use our full health pill just for one heart. Yeah, I know it seems like a waste, but you know, if we don't use it, that's even more of a waste. So we'll take this full heart, uh, full health pill, go over to the uh, blood bank, and uh, we'll give out our full, our heart, and we can use it twice. Actually, with the with the, um, this, wait, hold on, that's actually draining my. Uh, I can't have zero container hearts, otherwise it doesn't let me get that. Fuck. Really? Whatever. Yeah, never mind. Ooh, fly love. That might actually be useful, but if that's okay, if he gives me fly love, yeah, okay. Good. I kind of don't want it until later, until I've actually used up a lot of my money. Cause really, what I'm looking for right now is uh, spirit hearts, the lovers. Well, I can't really use that. Money? I don't need more money. Keys. That's really useful. Come on, Kane. God damn it, Kane. You got the luck for God's sake. You're supposed to get one of these things. It's okay. More money I don't even need. Okay, fine. God damn it. Bombs? I already have enough bombs. Oh god, troll bomb! Well, I'll see ya. <laughs> oh, it's up to you, fortune teller. Mr. Fortune Teller. Uh, tarot card. What's that? <laughs> Ton of temperance. <laughs> we might as well blow these shit up. <laughs> Two temperance uh, things. Yeah. Swell. <sighs> Lovers. I don't need. <laughs> I don't really need this. I might as well pop it. And waste it. Ooh, yes, I can just milk spirit hearts out of this thing for days. No, I don't want full, the full health pill. Even though it's completely useless to us right now. Red heart, no. By this point, I don't really want any trinkets. Huh? What is this? Oh, nice. Yay. But I'd still prefer the, uh, Book of Revelation, sorry. Alright, let's go. We got quite a few uh, quite a few spirit hearts out of that math, out of that deal. Oh, that's why we can't forget that bird card. I don't know whether to use it on. Uh, oh, I'll probably use it on a uh, on dead baby once we get there. We gotta hurry though. Oh, it's this guy. Okay, screw you. <laughs> With the brimstone, you can't do jacks a lot. Not against me anyway. Oh, come on, brimstone, charge faster. Yay. And they give you more stuff I don't even need. How wonderfully dandy is that? 
So we've got a lot of defense mechanics going on right for us. We've got the Halo Flies, Meat Boy, who also incidentally shoots. We don't need Hanged Man because we already have flying. Give me the Emperor card. Thank you. And Mom's Heart. And we've got the Polaroid, which will actually give us invulnerability uh, once we get hit. Actually, I don't know about that anymore because now that we've got the right Meat, I don't think that's uh, applied anymore. This sucks. If that's the case, then I should have not taken the, uh, the, the health upgrade in that case. Dang it. Boom! Boom. 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 <laughs> We're just one-shotting these guys. We did. Hey, buddy. Boss room is down there. I'm going this way. Uh, s double sloth. Well, nothing that uh, brimstone can't solve. Come on, shoot the real brimstone. Shoot it. Yes. Good cane. Good cane. The stars. Well, that takes us right to the. Uh... Wait, hold on. Ah, oh, fuck! I just screwed myself. God damn. And these bomb flies, bad draw, bad. Oh, I actually can get rid of it. Actually, no, I want to complete that because uh, it'll give me another charge on Book of Revelations. Fuck you, get off me, bitch. Thank God for flying. Otherwise, this would be an extremely tricky room to deal with. Fuck. Die, you sons of. More hearts and coins I don't I can't even use. <sighs> okay, going back. I forgot the stars is, is the card where it takes you to item room, but because there's no item room in the uh, cathedral, you can't really. It just takes you to a random place. God, that's key. That's fucking fun. Hold on, one, two, three, four. Now, oh yeah, we'll just go straight and see. We'll just take a. Oh come on! Fucking meat boy. Sometimes. Shit. Chain reaction. Chain reaction. Oh, Jesus. That's a champion piece. Yeesh. Uh, yeah, there's no way in hell I'm gonna get that bomb. So, see ya. Another double slot? Double sloth. Just blowing up the entire place. Die, sloth. Oh, meat boy. <laughs> meat boy kill sealed me. God damn it. The Empress. Uh, I don't think we can actually get uh, come back out of the room. Can we? I don't know. I don't know if we can actually come back out. Well, in any case, the Emperor is still going to serve us better than the, uh... Cue awesome epic music. Too bad the sound quality isn't as good as it could be. But, uh... In fact, what I may end up doing is, uh... Putting the audio for the Binding of Isaac, the uh, my mo innermost apocalypse, just for this, uh, just for this video, just for the boss fights against uh, Dead Baby and um, Isaac, because the, the music is just so goddamn epic. Thank God I have Brimstone too, because that makes that makes Isaac not able to fire as fast as he normally would. Though his homing shots are still. He fires him so suddenly and without warning that it's hard to tell when he's going to hit him. Yeah. He should be sitting pretty here, because Brimstone does a lot of damage. Plus Meat Boy shooting at him uh, constantly. Oh god, he's shooting more of those shit things. We should be able to finish this 
no problem. And just preserve as much of our fear hearts as we can and avoid getting hit at all costs. So we we need as much HP as we can to deal with uh, dead baby. Shit, that's gonna be Oh sh Don't avoid the cracks, disguise. Okay, good. We've gotten take care. We've gotten uh oh damn. Did Miku just save my life right there? Oh yes, we can actually go back out. Um dang it, then we should just use the Emperor car uh, Emperor's car here. What a whatever. Let's go into just Alright. Moment of truth. Ooh, yes, Rainbow Baby. Freaking awesome. Uh teleport. Nope. No thank you. Dead bird? Yum heart? Uh dead bird's useful, at least, because it'll give us more uh damage or damage capabilities uh when we get hit. And it only it only takes one time to for us to get hit. Rainbow Baby is a really good draw in, in my opinion anyway. Ah, uh, double curtis, fuck. Nice. Damn it. This is rough. This is really rough. We might as well pop the Emperor card now. In fact, we should. <laughs> what am I thinking? Alright, dead baby. It's you and me, boy. You and me. Oh, he's spawning! Flies? Bullshit! I call bullshit. I didn't know you'd do that. And he's even tougher than Isaac. Oh, this is such bullshit. Even still, with Brimstone, that's not much of a problem. But if you don't have Brimstone... Don't ask me how I'm dodging all these. The flies and Meat Boy are blocking the most of them for me. Not my skill. No, no skill required. Just Meat Boy and uh, flies are doing, doing, uh, saving my asses here. But this is one of the reasons why Brimstone is one of the most awesome items in the game because that makes your final bosses become pretty much twice as easy or half as hard, I should say, in this case, because they're not easy by any stretch. Of Damn it, don't pin me here. He's seeing out more and more flies right now. Now flies and fetuses. Oh wow, I didn't I can't believe I didn't I didn't I can't believe I didn't run into that guy. Ah oh, fuck. Dead bird! Do something for me! God damn it! You're useless with Eve. You can be not as useless here. He's done. Yes, we beat the game. Oh, gather E Kane's eye. I don't even know what that does. <laughs> to be honest. Well, we beat the game. Let's end it. Yay. So thank you guys very much for watching. This has been a very successful run with Kane. As you guys look through the end credits, hopefully my space and my disk drive isn't dying yet. Oh yeah, you can you guys can see it right there. Uh, but yeah, uh, you guys saw that C drive, or if you guys couldn't see that, it was I was recording uh, Binding of Isaac into my E drive, and um, it went from about 220 gigs or 227 gigs all the way down to 93. So that's just how much space that recording T boy uh, requires. So it's been nearly 50 minutes now. Holy shit! So, yeah. Thank you guys very much for watching. I beat the game with Kane. I think that was my first time actually beating uh, the chest with Kane. Hmm, interesting. So, yeah. I will see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed. Good shit that.